What's going on guys? I have a sick unboxing for you today. It is the ASD Motorsports hydraulic e-brake, the 16 inch pullback with the extra reservoir for the dual caliper setup that I'm doing on my M3. Let's get right into it. So to start this unboxing, got our handy dandy key knife. I also just noticed this, uh, you know, sticker made in the USA. Looks like we got a installation guide and hardware. And also, if you have bleeding issues on your uh, dual caliper setup, then you can follow this. I did order the one for the dual calipers, so it does have the separate reservoir. And uh, I also got the 3AN adapters, which will help out a little bit. Got some sick stickers. I asked them specifically to send me some because I do want to put one on my car. I think they look pretty cool. It'll be sweet. And last but not least, this beast. Oh man, oh. One more sticker. That's pretty sick. Oh, oh, oh man, dude! Oh, huh, huh. That is insane. This thing is so dope. I mean, oh my god! Like, so sick. Feels amazing in your hand. Quality is awesome. I cannot wait to get this on my car. Oh my god. Looking it over, looks very nice. Big tall handle. I love the simple design of it. I didn't want one of the ones with the weird grips. I just wanted the straight, you know, straight pole. Willowwood uh, Reservoir, which is pretty sweet. Pop this thing open. There you go. Not a whole lot else in this box. Just uh, your basic setup. I actually like how it's already bolted together, that way I don't have to do anything else. Feels nice and good. So this system here is the 16 inch pull back e-brake with the uh, reservoir for the dual calipers in the rear. That's two calipers per wheel or one extra caliper per wheel next to your other brake caliper. It's a .750 or three quarter inch master cylinder size. And the hardware adapter is the uh, negative 3AN. Uh, it was an extra eight bucks for that, but it was recommended by the, uh, the shop I was talking to. And uh, yeah, should be pretty sick. Getting the, the bigger lines put on. Uh, pretty excited. So as you can read right here, if you have ordered the ASD negative 3AN or minus 3AN hardware kit with your ASD e-brake, it has already been pre-installed for you prior to leaving ASD. It includes the adapters, crush washers, stat-o seal, and aircraft washers ready to plumb into your existing setup. If you have ordered the hardware kit, you will have a blue or red cap on the parts. Brake fluid requirements, nothing special for the setups. Continue to use what you normally would, and it will have no effect to your e-brake. Always make sure to use a quality brand fluid in your race car. Bro, race car. Sick. Anyhow, inlet and outlet of pass through master cylinder, blah 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 blah, trouble bleeding brakes, plumb backwards. Okay, cool. Since this is for the dual calipers, I believe it only has the one line that goes in and out. Um, I'm not entirely sure. I mean, this is the first handbrake I've ever bought, and uh, I guess we'll figure that out. I am having somebody else install it for me as I'm not familiar with how brake lines are supposed to be ran in your car. I know how they work, obviously, but I mean for a whole separate system. I'm getting all the other parts probably next week as uh, the shop that I'm talking to is developing a new bracket. So chances are I will have a test car for Detroit Drifting Company and uh, Detroit Drift Co, I guess you could call it. And uh, okay, the dog's freaking out. I'll have the test car for them, and uh, or one of them at least. They're doing different brackets for the rear calipers. It'll be Willwood, uh, calipers mounted on there and then uh, they're develop, gonna develop a uh, bracket to mount this inside nice and snug so you don't have to cut anything or anything like that if you guys need anything done or any parts look them up link in the description below I also have these life with tie t-shirts link available in the description below to go buy one 
Go check them out. Back to this thing. I'm in love with how it looks. Let's go, uh, let's go sit in the car and see how this thing, uh, fits in there. Okay. All I gotta say is this is gonna be so rad once it's installed. Oh my God. Just look at how this thing sits in here. Obviously it's not mounted right now, but it'll probably sit somewhere right there. So you can be driving and then just whap, whap, whap. And, then sh and it won't affect my uh, shifter at all. You can still move that. Only thing I'm worried about are the window switches, but I'm gonna imagine the bracket's gonna sit off to the side of those. Just so I have enough room, probably like that. I don't know, but it's gonna be sick. I cannot wait. This thing is just nutty. Well, there you have it, guys. That's the ASD Motorsports 16 inch pullback hydro e brake. This thing is really sick, and I'm so pumped to get this in the car. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna send it, gonna send it. But uh, yeah, waiting on parts next week because they're still developing the brackets for the car. For the E46 chassis as well as the mount for the hydro itself gonna pick those up and uh, probably get it on next week right after I get the parts because why wouldn't I it's gonna be dope then we'll do some mad skids gonna be sick if you like these shorter videos let me know drop a comment below or if you like the longer 10 to 12 minute videos just let me know so I can judge what I'm doing it's a lot easier to make the shorter ones and I can do a lot more sick editing so let me know about those also Hit that like button and that subscribe button if you haven't already. There's a lot more content coming, a lot more drift content, a lot more car stuff, all kinds of stuff. So make sure you subscribe and I'll see you guys in the next video. Let me